Hi everyone. Today I want to talk about how should you dress in your practice. Now, I know that some people would say, for example, if you follow a hidden path, maybe you should wear some apron dress. Other would say that maybe if you are a satanist that you should wear some gothic clothes. Well, yes and no. Let me explain. First of all, you should be able to wear anything you want in your practice. Okay, it's not the, what you wear that makes your practice or honoring your God uh, better. By that I mean, if you don't look like like me a heathen, as you can say, I don't dress like one. Well, that doesn't mean that I can't honor my God or that I'm not as serious in my practice. Now, yes, if I wish I could wear apron dress, but I'm not a dress person. Also, there are some people that wear some t-shirt with Bex Bezier and runes and um, maybe like uh, one ticket to Valhalla, things like that. Now, yes, these can be cool shirts, but you don't need them to, to do your practice. Okay, that goes for any other uh, path that you follow. Well, there might be only uh, one specific occasion when you need to maybe wear something like, for example, a cloth, if you're doing a special ritual, or maybe if you're part of a coven and they ask you to dress in a certain way. But other than that, you can wear anything else that you want. Now, I know that um, some of you can wear anything they please. That's fine. That's okay. Some will show their um, their path or the divinities that they worship. That's great too. But I know that others will be um, more maybe hesitant um, to wear these kind of clothes. There can be a couple of reasons for that. Can be because at their work, you know, they have to dress a certain way. Can be simply because they doesn't like the style. Or maybe because they're still in the, the closet. That's perfectly fine. <laughs> Now, I'm going to show you some little tips that can maybe help you to um, honor your God in your own ways, but that won't tell anyone which path you're on. What I mean by that? Let's start. Now, first of all, here you can see I have a simple t-shirt, a black one. Okay, so for example, I wear black on Saturdays because um, Saturday is Hecate's day and I know Hecate loves black. So I wear this. Now, I'm not saying that you have to dress from head to toe in black if you don't want to or you know, you feel that the, like some people it's more associated with death or things like that. You can wear simply a t-shirt or a pants, socks, underwear, or maybe a simple headband, just like that, if you wish. can be as simple as that. Or for example, as I follow Houdin, well this one is a little uh, light, but you can wear blue, just something like that, and when you wear it, you're thinking about honoring Odin on this day, which is Wednesday. And that's a, a little something 
no one will notice but you will know can be for example some jewelry like simple little bottle like that can be with rune on it or it can be a little bolder like this one depending on what you wish to wear um, now these these two comes from Busweiter Craftman and this one came from this one is for from Metal Weaver's creation so you can wear that you can also wear if you don't if you wish to maybe some oils like that like this one is for Odin and this oil is made by the herb witch shop there's also some Freya's oil so you can wear simply a little bit of this oils no one will know they will think that it's your perfume that you wear just like any uh, other perfume you can also um, you can also simply um, put some lipstick on if you like to to put some makeup I would say for example you can put some um, strawberry gloss and as you know strawberry is associated with Freya so that's another way to honor her and no one will see or know that you know you're you're wearing it for your goddess and these are simple little tips that you can do and i thought that i would share them with you and let you know that no you don't need to wear a specific thing and that you know sometimes just a little things here and there and can make your life simpler and can help you um, in your path if you want to so thank you for joining me and see you next time <laughs>